All right, so right now this is the very first episode of Samsung Quick Tips. We're well, kind of to show you guys a very quick video, a very quick trick that you do on your phone without kind of uh, keeping you here for too long. So the first thing we're gonna look at today is gonna be Samsung Wi-Fi. Now with Samsung Wi-Fi or Samsung Secure Wi-Fi is the correct term rather. Here as you guys can see right now I'm on Brooks Wi-Fi. This is my secure network. So right now my protection is unsecure. Right now I'm gonna switch over to Xfinity Wi-Fi, which is the public Wi-Fi that Comcast uh, offers to anyone who has a Comcast account. And as you guys can see right now, it is on secure Wi-Fi. Make sure I zoom it in for you guys right there. So to get this going, what you want to do is you're going to hit, you're going to hit the details, the, the name under your Wi-Fi. You're going to go down here to details. Then you're going to go to advanced. Now, right now, next you're going to see network settings. You're going to hit secure Wi-Fi. For what I've seen, I think T-Mobile and some UK variants have it. I have not seen this on Samsung. I know T-Mobile for sure has this. So right now, what you're going to do is, as you can see, it says protected. Now I can stop this if I wanted to, but since I'm since it's an unsecured Wi-Fi, I'm not gonna do that. But let's just say you're somewhere like maybe at a Starbucks or a McDonald's, and you're in that Wi-Fi and you're not sure it's secure. Don't worry about it. Samsung has that protected for you. It's gonna go to auto protect unsecured Wi-Fi. So even if you're not sure, it's gonna automatically detect that it's not and turn it on for you. Now for those who are not for me, what secure Wi-Fi is really in layman's terms, it's pretty much a VPN. So if you heard, if you ever heard of anything like Express VPN or Nord VPN or anything like that, you pretty much have that already baked into your phone just at a way cheaper price point. So Samsung offers their own. And what you can also do is you can actually have it set up on certain apps. If you don't, maybe you don't want a certain app to use a secure Wi-Fi. I wouldn't know, you know, I wouldn't know why you wouldn't, but let's just say if you did, they have that option for you. And you also have a Wi-Fi protection plan. Now the plan that I have is only two bucks and it's unlimited per month. Uh, you also get 250 megabytes per month for free. And then you also have the 24 hour, uh, 24 hour unlimited uh, one for a dollar. Now again, if the whole month is two dollars, but one day is a dollar, I mean, kind of do the math on that. Um, then you also have it where you can set up individual Wi-Fi, right? So maybe again, like as you know, as, as you guys saw in the beginning, I was on my own personal Wi-Fi, so I didn't need the protection on. You actually add trusted Wi-Fi networks to this, so you ain't have to worry about that. So if you were maybe you know if you're at home, or you're at a friend's house, and they always have secure Wi-Fi, boom, you add that network there. It knows that it's trusted, it won't turn it on. Hope you learned something today. Again, my name is Sean Be Nice. This was Samsung Quick Tips. Deuces.